YouTube, YouTube, what it do, man? Y'all tune in and make it make sense, man. You know what I'm saying? This is the uh, podcast show, whatever you want to call it, where we try to make things make sense. And today, man, we're going to break down this situation that happened in Dallas over the weekend, man. Rapper Big Boogie was headlined to do a uh, second annual Easter Bike Festival in Dallas, you know what I'm saying, in an open field located in Oak Cliff. You know what I'm saying? I don't know if y'all know about Oak Cliff or what's going on, but Oak Cliff is like supposed to be the hood part of Dallas, like a rough part or whatever. But uh, he was scheduled to be the headliner along with a couple more Dallas rappers. And uh, reports say, man, a lot after 12 o'clock, gunfire opened and tragically, man, 11 people were shot, y'all. Check this out. 11 men were shot. Three of them um, were juveniles, and one 26-year-old ended up losing his life to the situation. You know what I'm saying? They have nobody in custody. You know what I'm saying? I don't think they're going to be holding, like, you know, if somebody get injured at a concert or something, they'll try to hold the artist liable for what happened. I, don't, I, ain't, I ain't heard nothing like that yet, you know what I'm saying? But I just know Big Boogie has a real... Uh, like a little uh, bad luck when it comes to situations like this, man. He didn't been in, you know what I'm saying? This about his third or fourth time he didn't had a show somewhere and it got shot up, you know what I'm saying? Now, me personally, I don't know if the situation that happened down and got something to do with Big Boogie. I just know he was headlining the show. He a CMG artist. So that's what everybody's saying. Uh, it was rumor going around talking about Big Boogie girl got killed or something. You know, what, you know what I'm saying? Doing the situation, but I have no, uh, I can't confirm that. So, you know, that's why I ain't just talking about that. But that's what I have heard on this situation. But Boogie, I don't know, it, it was like a little black cloud. He followed him around or whatever, but he don't be bothering nobody. He don't do nothing but do with music. If y'all go check his music, he really just talking about, you know what I'm saying? Like strip club music and popping women, popping pussy and all this shit. That's all really he rapping about, but for some reason, niggas want to try him or I don't know trying to stop what he got going on. Or uh, I, ain't, I ain't see no comment God had made about the situation, but y'all know that the internet is making this into some shit that it probably ain't even it. You know what I'm saying? After the young Dolph, then y'all know Snooty Wild just passed. Now this here, so CMG is kind of like staying in the headlines. But I don't know if it's for the right thing. But they always say, good publicity, bad publicity is all the same. It's all going to work in your favor. But uh, y'all tell me what y'all think about the situation, man. Hit the like button. Subscribe to the channel.